what's going on i just want to make a statement here i was in my shower this morning literally just i love taking showers i sit down i turn the water on i meditate i think connect to things whatever and i'm like you know what maybe coronavirus because it's it's the common cold i mean a lot of people already dis discern that and it's just going through mutations or some people say it's a bioweapon whatever all these stupid things but honestly it could just be that the 5G spectrums are causing these issues with the common cold. This is nothing new, especially if you've been following my channel of the uh, Invisible Rainbow book by that Arthur Freisenberg gentleman who is one of those technological refugees of this new electrical spectrums, shooting them pulse through the air and all that. So perhaps china because china has been rolling it out really quickly they're trying to be number one with technology and i don't i, I don't know the fascination about that but i mean we live on a pretty advanced being called the earth but i digress so i was just looking at this and then this guy's like bashing on people who are thinking that 5g has anything to do with the coronavirus and this is like damage control like oh we have to hurry up and say something because there's too many people who are thinking that 5g technology is causing some type of issue so i look up this dude his name's brian clark and then he's working for the next web services i haven't looked much into this i'm going further um this news is headquarters in amsterdam and Let's look. Let's see who is funding this. Financing is purchased. Majority stake. So, English language international data newspaper owned by Japanese companies. Headquartered in London. Paper was owned by James Sheridan. This is what I do. I find out where this is coming from because this dude has... Like, it's legit. Like, 5G and cellular technologies causing viruses and the flu to pandemics, it's documented. It's... Just, here you go. Read about it. It's there. All the research has been done. This gentleman did such great work in his book discussing this. And how we need safer alternatives to technology. And there are clean electronics. And that's what we should focus on. But I digress. A lot of people just want to roll this shit out. And this Brian Clark dude is like, oh, how dare you? Because I work for these Financial Times newspapers. I mean, I don't know. Do they have stake in the 5G technology? Do they have investments? Do they have some reason... I mean, I could figure it out. Here's the here's an owner. Let's see if they have interests in 5G tech. Japanese holding companies here business as its core. Boo, 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 boo. It is also the owner of TX Network and TV Tokyo. Commercial Television Network. Companies in books, magazines, digital media, database services, broadcasting. Broadcasting. So I'm pretty sure these people are part of that electrical communications pact with Verizon and all those other companies and whoever. I'm not too uh, <laughs> into, uh, integrated into their knowledge base of what companies what. Because honestly, I think they're all going to go away soon because people don't like being sick. So... Good luck being that guy who makes everyone sick. <laughs> Good luck. 